What is up, folks? This is Eric Ast, and welcome back to Spiritfarer. All right, so today I have a few plans. One, I want to do some upgrades on some buildings. And two, I want to go around and grab everything that I can find from zip lines because that is what we got in the last episode, is the ability to use them. Also, I've been doing Fire Glow seeds because when you do the event, it actually gives you the seeds and not the actual uh, fire glow. So that was a bit of an issue. I was actually kind of shocked to see that because I was not paying attention when I did that. I was paying more attention to the event than what I actually got from the event. So yeah, we are at, was it Nordsea? Is that correct? Yeah, Nordsea Pier. So there is, a, at least one zip line here. I think there are actually a few that are connected together. So let's go ahead and grab this and see what we can get. I imagine it's probably a treasure thing of some sort. One of those little uh, pillars that has a, a thing on it. Like that, right there. Um, how do I get up there again? I guess I jump up here and then I'll go over here. Okay, and then I'm pretty sure it's at the top. It'd be nice if we could use that. Yeah, there it is. Unless it's just a rope. Oh, there we go. I'll let you just take us to the right to the beginning. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Oh, the big giant uh, light bulb. All right, what have we got? Lettuce seed, and we've actually picked up something else too. Is that a letter? A key? Music? We do have a key. Okay, so that's for the mine that we went to last time. And I already knew I had some bamboo. What was that I picked up? I wanna know what I picked up. No, nothing here. I've got my fire glow, and I did get some peaches for my tree. I do have one thing of aluminum on one of the turtles, so that is a thing. Um, we should have aluminum here pretty soon. I don't know what I got. It didn't say. Oh, I do want to open those. There's 100 and there's 600. Okay. I I don't know what that was. Well, that's concerning. I mean, it's not going to hurt us any. I don't think. But <laughs> now I've got something that I have no idea what it was. So it kind of looked like some music or something, but it wasn't. Huh. I don't know. Um, hmm. Okay, so let's go ahead and do some upgrading is nighttime. All right, so improve. Now that we have some fire glow, we can improve our original residence and make some hanging lights. So let's go do that. Um, it's only 350, it's not that expensive, so. There we go, and now we've got some lights, star lights, oh, inside. Um, we can't do this one just yet, I need aluminum and I need ash planks and uh, ectoplasm. So can't do that one. Um, nothing to do at Gwen's. She's not with us anymore anyway. Um, I need zinc and ash. I need a lot of stuff that I don't have. Um, I need more aluminum. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Nothing. Okay, there's one. All right, so seven bright jelly, so I have just enough. I need slate, which I have plenty of, and I've got plenty of maple planks as well. So let's go ahead and do this one. Your cereal will grow faster. Sweet. All right, so we've upgraded that one. And there's another one over here. I know she's not with us anymore, but this one takes aluminum, which I don't have. But this one takes wool, glass, and limestone, all of which I have enough of. So let's go ahead and put those uh, pictures up. Um, I don't 
see actual new pictures because those other pictures were already there, right? I'm confused. Okay, well, whatever. <laughs> um, so let's go ahead and do that. And I will meet you guys at the next zip line in the morning. Okay, so I was searching around and we are on this island. I can't for the life of me remember the name of it. Um, like I was just saying, if I pulled up one of the menus, it would tell me. Um, but yeah, so we're over here. I was looking for zip lines because I can't remember where they are. <laughs> and I was just, I was jumping around and I, well, that's weird. <laughs> so, if we double jump and go to the left, you'll run over here. Now this actually has bothered me for a while. I think I mentioned it. This is the shaft that has an air thing at the bottom. Sweet, so we got a figurine. But this had bothered me because there's air coming up here. And I was like, well, this isn't the top of the shaft, but this is as high as we can go. So I was like, what is up there? Well, now I know. So, yeah, now we have an extra figurine, which is going to help us uh, fill out for our collector friend. Uh, but yeah, so I'm going to keep looking because I can't remember where everything is. I'm just going to all the islands that uh, I have, things that I haven't collected yet. Uh, treasures and, you know, that sort of thing. I think, okay. It's like, I haven't been over here in a while. I don't remember exactly what is over there. Um, so yeah, uh, I will say real quick, sorry for my voice. It's a little growly today. Um, I've had a sore throat since last night. So yeah, thankfully I do have some honey. So I've just been doing that. <laughs> but anyway, I will see you guys in a little bit. Okay, so actually it's been about, I don't know, 15 seconds. <laughs> uh, even less for you guys. But somebody wants to talk to me, so let's talk. Have I told you that after the war, I opened a tavern? Working in sales wasn't my thing, and Astrid's mother said that she wanted to help us. So I said to my, or told myself, hey, sure, why not? It was a reputable establishment something fancy not a drinking hole where people would come to forget about their lousy lives so one day a client comes in disheveled obviously distraught looking over his shoulder as if dogs of inferno were after him he runs to the bar grabs him by the collar and tells me in a panic 12 shots of your finest liquor before I even have the time to come back with a bill, he's almost through half of them. You better get that bill paid real quick, because, uh, yeah. So I ask him, brother, <laughs> brother, what's going on with you? Why are you drinking so fast? To which he answers, if you had what I have, you wouldn't be drinking, or you would be drinking very fast too. Surprised and a bit scared, I flat out asked him, What in heavens do you have? Mm -hmm. He then stands up right away and tells me, Only 50 cents and dashes through the door. Lord. Well, Peanut, it's been 40 years and I'm still laughing at this one. <laughs> yeah. All right. So that's how that works. I wondered, because she's no longer with us. So, like, well, how is this gonna work? Well, now I know. It's been pretty easy so far. Let's just go up this ladder and then go back down. And then I go up the ladder and then I go back down. Okay. And last one should be this one. So come over here. Oh, nope. There's one more. Oh, come back. A little speedy. There we go. 
And there we are. So we get some more nebula fiber, which I am in need of. I heard a little bloop sound. But I don't see any exclamation points or anything like that. And we're actually still traveling, even though it's fairly late at night. Uh, but anyway, on to my next destination, which is harvesting corn. <laughs> okay, so here we are at a quarry. Uh, Hosekai or Hosuke? I'm not sure. Um, obviously, my Japanese is not very good. But let's go ahead and see what we've got up here. Nothing so far. I need to check these walls to make sure I can't go through them. Oh, no! Darn it. No! <laughs> okay. Phew. <laughs> Where am I going now, though? Um... Okay, so I need to be up there, but how do I get up there? The heck? Because that's really far. Okay, so I held right the whole time, and it didn't do anything. Huh, whoops. Um, I'm going to mess around here a little bit, and if I figure something out, we'll come back. Um... If I don't, then I guess I'll turn up somewhere else then. <laughs> I'll see you guys in, in I don't know how long. <laughs> okay, so I found something interesting. It didn't require a zip line, but I'll show you how to get back here in just a second. So let's go ahead and see what it is. A vintage poster, so probably just money. But... So you go over here, and we're at uh, this place. <laughs> we're at this place. That's exactly where we are. So if we go to the right, we go to the guy that talks about the mountain. Look at the mountain. All right. So if we go left, however, let's go to the top, and then... We'll just go down over here, and that's how you get that. So it's just right above this place. Um, I've noticed actually that there are treasures above these places pretty much everywhere I've gone. Uh, there are raccoon friends. So yeah, hope you guys recognize this island because I don't remember the name. And I feel bad about that, but uh, we picked up our friend um, who was looking for the um, antique, I guess I'll say, here. Oh, there's another one right there. So if we glide a little bit more, maybe we can get this one too. Yeah. What do we got here? Some seeds, some leek and rice seeds. You look like you're on a mission. Let me guess. My mom sent you, right? Sure. It was a matter of time. I like being on this lamppost. I like taking my time. If that doesn't gel with my mom and her concept of time, well, too bad. <laughs> her house, her rules, I don't think so. <laughs> I'm going to go live in the mountains and not bother anyone. Mm -hmm. Let's see if she likes that. <laughs> There's one up there. How do I get to that one? Um, what if I go from the top of the house? So let's go. Oh, I can't slide on this house. Oh, there we go. So if we go from up here, maybe we can get it. I think we might need the dash, though. Yeah, I can't get to it. Okay, so we're going to have to need... Or I'm going to come back to that one. There is a... I know there's a dash ability. I don't know exactly how it works. Um, but I think that's probably what we're going to need for that one. And the uh, one in the mine that we couldn't get to. So, 
unfortunately, we'll have to come back to it. But I've explored most of the islands around here. I think she should be just about ready. She's had that exclamation point beside her ever since I put it down. So I'm like, well, that's not, I mean, mm. actually, I'm going to go salvage these crates first and see if we can get some more that way that we have that way we have every bit as much as we can uh but yeah so be right back Alrighty, so we are on our way to go see albert about our sneaky friend summer uh she's been having a hard time lately she's cold constantly so we're gonna see what we can do all right but we are able to make the gallery so let's go ahead and do that um do i want to make it down here i can put it up here yeah i'm gonna just put it up here that is a really tall ladder um i'm just gonna put it up here for now so we also have a couple more things that we can make um we can make our zip line which i'm kind of I'm kind of curious. Like, can I make a something that's huh? Do I put one like here? Well, they're kind of expensive. I don't have much wool thread. Is the problem? I'm gonna hold off on that. All right. So let's exit out of that. Um, I do still. I still can't make the windmill. Uh, you'll notice I have two aluminum ingots now. So I went ahead and used both of our turtle friends um, and did six off of that. We got seven from um, the one that I did plant last time. So now we've got two. <laughs> There's six spots. So yeah. And I've got one more aluminum from somewhere i guess oh right you get two aluminum ingots per process so yeah i've got one ore left um we can't see that but anyway so i can't make the crusher because it takes a lot of things that we don't have and i don't have ash planks to make the chicken coop so that's where we stand with all that i've actually got quite a bit of money um i went through and sold some stuff uh cherry trees are probably the most consistent way of making money i would say you get seven per harvest and you can sell them for 50. so it's actually not bad all right what is it oh if i don't know that face it's about the house the green and brown one right i'm sort of have some sort of problem with it do you yeah, I could see it from a mile away. Listen, I know my job. Me and my boys were real professionals. And it's not often that we criticize another worker's craftsmanship. But that house, oh wow. It had to be the worst job I've ever seen. Wow. So consider this a lesson and don't just trust any old amateur always go to a professional so tell me what complaints does your passenger have what she's sleeping oh of course the bald head of hers is very sensitive to temperature changes imagine how cold she must be not mentioning her dry and scaly skin oh no 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 <laughs> she needs a temperature and humidity control system I can't speak. <laughs> Luckily, that place was so shoddily designed that there's a simple or there's ample cracks for wiring and electronics. So yeah, there you go. Some plans and schematics for a nice all-in-one HVAC system. Pro quality. Call it a courtesy. After all, how can you repay your debt if your boat falls apart? Or I've played, paid you a ton at this point. All right, so just to see, yeah, I've got 65,000. So I've got a good amount of money. I don't have silk powder or 
Zinc ingots, so can't do that. Rock destroyer, I need one more spirit flower and some aluminum, so can't do that. I can do this. I might as well. I mean, there's no harm in it. It's going to make our boat extra long. Um, that's the one thing that I'm concerned about at the moment. I might move everything off the ground. That way I can just move more quickly. I don't know. I'm going to have to figure that out. Um, so the flawless beluga. Sweet. More room. And I need 45,000, so another 10,000 to get the silent orca. Okay. And then the fearless whale is 80,000. So we've got a bit to go before we can we can buy that all right so let's go see if we have what it takes to make our hvac system kind of doubt it why uh, just a feeling all right so improve fantastic all right i'll talk to you in a minute <laughs> let me see what it takes oh i do have what it needs so to get glass you can actually smelt some bottles um, I think that's a lot cheaper way to actually get it, so let's keep that in mind. All right, so complete all-in-one professional quality heating, ventilation, and air conditioning units. Sweet. All right. Ow. All right. So let's go ahead and go over here. Hey there, Summer. How are you doing? Still fuzzy. Oh, Stella. I think I might have overslept a bit. How long have I been sleeping? What? That much? Hibernating, you say? Well, I guess it was bound to happen. I might have been ignoring what my body was trying to tell me a little bit. A bad habit of mine. Thank you, Stella, for taking such good care of me. You're welcome, Summer. I'm not a big snake person, but you're very, very sweet. Fantastic. As usual, Stella, you accomplished your end of the deal with Gusto. And while I noticed that you disregarded much of my previous indications, what a great space you managed to put together. It will be a much better working environment than that noisy guest house. As a plus, I can even move in so that I can entirely focus on my work. Oh, don't act surprised. I've only ever felt at home when surrounded by my work. Uh -huh. While some might consider sleeping in their office a punishment, I'm actually looking forward to it. I can't wait to fill up this empty space. How exciting. Uh -huh. Do carry on. I'll gather, yeah, I know, I know. I'll gather my things and my thoughts, and I'll tell you when we're ready for the next step. Sweet. Eh, it's pretty empty. I know, I haven't forgotten. I'm working on it. Just need some aluminum. And I need some fat, I think. So, not entirely sure uh, how I go about getting that just yet. Maybe in the next area. Hopefully in the next area. We'll see. Alright, let's water our plants. I have to do this so often. I wish there was some kind of watering system. I really do. I really, really do. All right. So anyway, I think that's actually going to wrap us up for today. Um, we do still have some things that I need to take care of, especially harvesting that aluminum, but we'll, we'll take care of that next time. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And again, sorry about my voice. I know it's growly, but I want to get this out for you guys. So yeah, well, hopefully that'll get better before the next episode. <laughs> we cross our fingers. Um, but anyway, hope you guys enjoyed, and until next time, take it easy. <laughs>